Do you ever think about how the people that you pay tax dollars to take that money, fund their salaries, and then come up with endless, frivolous lawsuits and rules and laws to make your life more difficult? Hey everyone, Dylan Schumacher, Citadel Defense. So I found out a couple days ago, as of the time I'm filming this, that the ATF decided that they are no longer going to allow civilian uh, smoke grenades and, and flashbangs, like using like airsoft games and stuff. The, those are no longer allowed and those are now considered explosives because some bureaucrat behind a desk somewhere changed their mind about something. So there is a bunch of obvious problems with this, right? Namely that uh, somebody just decides someday and now there's a new law that all of a sudden you have to be held accountable to, that you can't have smoke grenades or flashbangs anymore because those are considered explosives under the ATF. I mean, what, what do we even have the ATF for? It's alcohol, tobacco, and firearms. All of those things are legal. Why do we need a policing organization for that? Would, would someone explain that to me? Now, in the long run, this is probably gonna get struck down because that's how things have been going recently, thank God. I mean, they've just lost out on the pistol brace. They lost out on the frame and receiver rule. They're throwing darts. They have nothing. But in the meantime, when they make up a new law and they just, again, completely fabricated, nobody voted on this. There was no congressional approval, none of that. Just the ATF just making something up, writing a letter, and that's it. That is the law that you will go to prison for, for, I don't know, 10, 20, 30 years for now owning something that yesterday was a thousand percent legal. That, that kind of thing is, uh, I don't know, evil. So, like I said, it'll probably get struck down. I'm sure it'll get removed, but that's really not the point. In the meantime, your life is inhibited. Your freedom is curbed and you no longer now can buy these items that maybe you were using for training, maybe you're using for paintball games or airsoft games or just fun because you like colors coming out of smoke, right? Like, it's America, you should be able to do what you want, but now that's considered an explosive device. Because again, somebody wrote a little letter, signed it, and sent it to FFLs to say, oh yeah, by the way, uh, we know those were legal yesterday, but actually today that's a felony. I, if, if you just consider how retarded that is for a second, it really boggles the mind. If only we had some like body in this country that we elected people to, and then they pass laws through discussion and decisions, and then those things are what became laws. If, if only we had a system like that, maybe this wouldn't happen. So if you got those smoke grenades and those flashbangs out there, boys, um, you know, I don't know, be safe with them, have fun, do some training, don't do anything illegal, be brave. Endure. We're going to need you.